don't know her name. Oh, you did. Mm -hmm. Oh, you don't know her name. I don't know her name. Her name. You so that the whole time it was, was never told to me. Mm -hmm. She and her husband lived in Poland. They they were rich. They had a cigarette factory. But uh, Grandma Grandma Rahalipa came to America, and her sister Sarah came to America. So she came also with her husband. So they sold their factory and they came here and uh, they saw you know, people were working six or seven days a week and she said, this is a type of lot and she went back. Oh, Joe God. was Grandma Heidi's baby brother. And he was the only one that went to college. Oh, just the them. only one who went to college. Yes. Now that was uh, This was Grandma Yetta Block. Grandpa <laughs> Philip's <laughs> mother. Grandpa Philip's mother. You have to figure it's a sheep. It's a sheep. Look at it close. It's a sheep. Oh, it's a dog. It's a dog. It's not a sheep. <laughs> a dog. Dog. And this is the yeah. same woman. I think this that? is before my Grandpa wedding. Grandpa looked like her. Grandpa Philip's mother. Grandpa Philip's mother. Cool. Oh, this, this is for my wedding. The two grandmothers uh, got together. But you know what? We took a picture of the negative, but it's reversed. Oh. Wait, so what? They, but I can uh, reverse it right. I can make it right. Yeah, you can Wait, make one it second. Right. These were... My two grandmothers. This is my father's mother and my mother's mother. Oh, so it was... The, wait, at whose wedding? My wedding. It was your grandmother at your wedding. Did they my like each other? Did they get along? They hardly saw each other. My grandma was very firm and she was not. Uncle Morris. Mm. This is who your mm -hmm. name is, Uncle Morris. Uncle Morris. I Thank keep on forgetting the kids never met. Mm -hmm. These people. Yeah. Businessman. Street, street smart. <laughs> street smart. Was he a mafia guy? He was a business, ge business genius. Was you he know a mafia guy? He wasn't a mafia no. guy. No, you know what? When, when Tante, oh, Fern, when like Tante Fern and Uncle Avi got married, they lived in a building on Queens Boulevard. Well, mm. Uncle Mars went to buy that building. And he went there. And I don't know, the people who were selling it didn't want to give Uncle Joe his way for back. some reason or other. So Uncle Joe said, that's it, we're walking out. And he picked himself up and he walked out. Come on, Morris, we're walking out. So Morris walked out and said, Oh, I forgot something on the table. <laughs> he went back, he made the deal with the building. Yeah. You know who this is? This is Grandma Rahaliba, <gasps> Uncle Alex, and Morris Steinberg. Oh, my God. And Sarah's husband, Morris Steinberg. Mama, this is your grandmother that had No, my great grandmother. Oh. Wow, that's amazing. That's the youngest picture I have of her. That is so cool. Yeah. I can't believe it. And maybe it was on East 95th Street with where Morris lived at that time. Here, this. Uh, how, how old could I have been there? I don't know. Six. That's uh, so five. cool. No, I, I don't think I was five. No. Wait, let me see. Close. Here. Close that's the earliest picture of me. You and it was, taking, it was taken at 1163 Sutter Avenue where we lived as little children. Wait, it's you and who else? And Aunt Jeannie. Jeannie. Here we are on the roof <gasps> of our house. Oh my gosh, that's so cool, Ma. Mm. Who's that? That's great. That's, that's also your mom. Where did you find those that's pictures? That's Bubby and her sister them. and my grandmother and my grandfather. But that's grandma, the grandma grandma that had them. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. She was so sunning she's herself. So cute. She looks like a little Indian grandmother <laughs> with a little... <laughs> She was very cute, very cute. She was very cute. She was tiny, wasn't she tiny? She, yeah, she was very short. And sometimes I would take her into the shower. We had a stall shower in Carroll Street. So I would take her into the shower and, and uh, bathe her, you know? And, uh, and then come out and dry her up. And for Mother's Day or Hanukkah, we'd want to give her a present. She says, Give on this kind of present, not that this kind of present. Give me a girl. Mention Kuman. Zuchel need any presents? What do I need in my lifetime now? Just give me money. When people come to look for charity, I should have money to give them for charity. So that's what that's she said. Theoretically. This is in Brighton Beach. Here, here she is in Brighton Beach with Tante know? Becky and Grandma Idy. Oh, they look so happy. Yeah, we're happy. Those are nice days. 